Andy Johnson, we are looking at reading in the brain, specifically three cueing systems used to identify words. There is often confusion as to what is meant by cueing systems and reading. First of all, defining our terms, recognizing words, is different from identifying. Recognizing is systematic or automatic recall of words in our mental lexicon. Identifying words is a process or strategy that we have to use when we encounter a word that we do not automatically recognize a strategy. And there are six ways to identify words. The brain uses three cueing systems. Semantics, meaning we use the context of the sentence. This is what our brain is doing as it encounters a word. Syntax is grammar, word order, sentence structure, tense plurality. And again, we use this to create meaning with print. And phonological or graphophonological are the letters and sounds. This is the least efficient in terms of cognitive processing, time and space, how long it takes and how much space it takes in working memory. All right. This is three systems that the brain uses to cue us in to what that word might be. We call them systems because various parts of the brain work together, not one simple part. Now, this does not mean that we should not teach phonics. Instead, we need to include strategies to develop all three of the brain's cueing systems. A cueing system is not an instructional approach or a method or a pedagogy. In terms of word identification, we are talking about the systems that the brain uses to cue or recognize words during the process of reading. We also want to teach multiple ways to identify words. Keep in mind, Rather, we use minimal letter cues 